So I talked to some uh, designers, trainers, and leaders about uh, setting these learning objectives, right? So, okay, you should include consequences, statement of consequences, or statement of benefits. Consequence means what would happen if you're able, if this fails, or what would happen if this succeeds. And the unfortunate thing when I ask him this question, the outcome would be like, hey, Ray, we don't really know what are the consequences and what are the benefits. I said, well, that's really unfortunate because how can you remove the learning objective away from its impact at work? No wonder many of the learning objective doesn't stick to the learner's mind because it is so removed. It's like they're in Mars or they're in the moon and we're on Earth. So I would recommend that if you're writing content or making a presentation or doing a webinar, go back to where the consequences are and the benefits if they do or they don't do the content. In fact, all of my presentations, I always start with a concept is what will happen if you do or you don't do, because that's what grabs people's attention and that's what matters to people, the impact of their lives.